Hello and welcome back to this Let's Play of Oblivion with myself, Waze, and Yonston the Crow and Fergus. We're back in the room. It is uh, coming up to midday. We got a few hours kip after, well, we knocked back a bottle of wine to help us sleep and uh, grabbed a bit of grub. And we're ready to go and see, is it Odetta? What was her name again? Elveta. Making names up now. Um, to tell her that we've carried out her task. That she was so worried about us being capable of. Huh. The cheek of it. We've done we've done all right by the righteous so far. About time they started trusting us, to be honest. Let's go and see it. And uh mm. So we grabbed a, a little bit of a bite to eat. We haven't had a drink this morning. It's only been a, a few hours since our last one, so we, we figured we'd we'd wait a bit. Let's go and see Elveta and see what she's got for us next because we're all all out of quests. Um, what is it? I think she was in here, was she? Oh, what the hell? Where is she? What? Where's Elveta? How can we go and see Elveta if Elveta is not around? Strange. Hmm. Where might she be? Where might she be if she's not home? It's the middle of the day, Fergus. I mean, I know we were asleep, but we were up all night doing a job. What? So what's your problem? Okay. Good to see you. Ramira. Let's go and ha check out Righteous Hall, see if she's in here. And then maybe we'll go back to um, the thirsty peasant. This is a grand day. Greetings. Let's go and see. No, where did I put that? What have you lost, Fergus? All right, she's not in here. I doubt she'll be. Oh, maybe she'll be upstairs. Nope. Are these rooms? No. Definitely not here. Snow. We need more snow. What? Can't have enough snow. Yes, she can. Move to Skyrim if you want snow. Hello there. Right. Good afternoon. We'll check out the thirsty peasant. And then maybe we'll do a one. That name, Ramonius. Did we we still got that note, don't we? Let's have a look at that again. Was it the third note? No, that was the Alconius oh, one. Oh, God. That's the Maynard one. By Bren's command. Oh, hang on a second. By Bren's command, Ramonius Rucus. Didn't read that properly before. That was just Bren's people looking for the ring. So, yes, yeah, so obviously, we cleared them out. They're dead. If they were still looking, then they don't have it either. So Marvel's assumption, I think, is correct. And there's no need to look for Ammonius if he's working like for Brent. Well, thank you very much, Ramira. Um, yeah, so there's no, there's no need to go looking for Ammonius. We know who he is. And uh, why they were looking for it. There isn't someone else involved at all. My mind was getting a bit too carried away there. What? Where is Elveta? Yes. This is uh, interfering with my gameplay. Okay. Well, if she's not in here, I have no idea where she is. How are? I'm very happy to make your acquaintance. No, don't oh, you start. No. What is your problem, Ilmina? Hmm. Hi there. Hello. Let's go and check again. Where has she disappeared to? Let's see if he knows. Well met. Hiya. Um. No. 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 Nothing. It was worth a try. Nope, still locked. I don't want to break in. 
I don't think that would be right. Oh, so a nosy around the back. Oh. Oh. That's disappointing. No way in. Okay, it was worth a look. Right. Let's go and find Elvette and see if we can figure out where she is. How goes it? Wonder if she'll be in the the commerce district. It's possible, I suppose. Hmm. Fergus. Oh, he's gone again. We'll go and talk to Frillia. See if she's got any information about anything. What's this about? I didn't say anything. Me Johnson's a bit grumpy this morning. I suppose only getting four hours sleep isn't going to help much. The weary traveller. Now, this is the usual cronies. Hi, Aphrilia. Yes. Um, only quality goods for sale here. Glad what to hear I it. Uh, I'll have a, I'll have a couple of bottles of mead off you, please. Pleasure doing business with you. Thank you. Thank you. Come again. Um, what have we got? Any rumours? Anything going the on? The Imperial City itself is a walled city, with separate inner walls protecting the Imperial Palace. Yeah, I've been there. I've actually seen it. It's quite impressive. You should try and get the get there yourself if you if you haven't been. Um, okay. No, not going to get anything off that. Good day. Do you know what? Let's just sit down and have a couple of beers and uh, go back to... How do you do? Alveta later. Hello. Do you want something from Orcs me? Orcs don't ride horses. Fergus, don't... Horses. Don't... Mm -hmm. don't Sometimes I think they're the smart ones. Why do you always, why do you always sit further away? Maybe we could talk a little. <laughs> what do you think? Well, why not? We're going to have a few beers. So, what's news with the? What's I new don't with understand you? why the Arcane University don't let spell making and enchanting for all. In Morrowind, things weren't this way. Yeah, so I've heard. Um, is that it? That's all you wanted to talk about? That sounds like you just wanted to give out about something. Um, Please go on. Um, of course. What do you want to talk about? Are you ready to tell me a bit more about yourself? Ah, uh, yeah. I was talking about my advancements among the mage. Okay. Well, soon when I felt I was prepared, I decided to talk to the steward in Balmora. Mm -hmm. The steward was a dumber with a very bad temper. Ajira didn't like her, but I never had a problem, so I didn't mind. Several of her requests involved the stealing and the spying. I enjoyed it at first, since they put my stealth skills in good use. During one of my duties, I traveled to Vivek and met another woman, Hannah. She is a Nightblade from Hammerfell. Okay. And is this going to be another another disaster? Don't tell me you didn't you didn't try it on with her as well, did you? What happened then? It was love at first sight. Oh god. I spent some time in Vivek with her and then we moved to Balmora, where my friends were. Hannah has a very wild spirit. She travels a lot and never accepted to join a guild. She was in Vardenfell to try out new things. Okay. We planned to live together in Balmora, and I started to work more in the guild to save more money. That's when the steward asked me to kill a former member that became a necromancer. Mm. I didn't think twice, and I did as she asked. Okay. Later, her eyes felt upon Hannah. She knew that Hannah was a spellcaster, very good in alteration, and asked me to recruit her, or kill her. Oh dear. I was shocked. Hannah was my love, and I would never kill her. However, I knew that she would never join the guild. Okay, so tell me you didn't kill her. I talked to Hannah and for her safety, we decided that it was time to part our ways. Okay, good. Bribing some people, we had her embarked in a ship to Skyrim. When I came back, the steward was possessed. She accused me to betray the guild, spelled me and spread rumors that I was a necromancer. Ajira was on my side, but the steward's lies were so strong that I started to receive threats against my life. 
It was time to leave Vardenfell. Ajira promised to help me fix the things from there. Okay, you, this trouble does seem to follow you around. I, I think you, we were fated to be together. So that is that when you came to Cyrodiil? Yes. In fact, Cyrodiil looked like the best place. All my friends in Morrowind pointed me thirstworthy people from here. Okay, and then then what? I picked a hint about contacts in Braville and decided to hide myself there. But let's take a break on my story. These memories aren't good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. It, <laughs> Fergus, you've had it a bit rough. Right. Heard any news from As I said, provinces? fated. I they think say that slavery has been abolished in misery, misery likes House company, as they say. Marlo I think that's why we met. Right. And freed the beast now I'm gonna from servitude. sit down and. Morrowind has always been a troubling. We'll have these. Have these beers. We're a bit low on beer, but. I think we have plenty of wine, so we're, we're not sure. It seems it is more right, so now. let's go and check Elveta wow. again. And hope that she's home. Strange. What is it? Okay. How do you do? Yeah, poor old Fergus. He doesn't have much luck. It's, um... No, I haven't had much luck myself, but... It's starting to... It's starting to feel... That's why, that's why misery likes company. When you hear someone else has it worse, maybe you don't feel bad so bad about your own position. Hello. Hello. Right, Elveta, please be home. Otherwise, I have to do more waiting and wandering around and editing and all that kind of stuff. Salute. Welcome. Please say your piece. Nope, she's not home. Right, Fergus. Music stops suddenly. Right. Because. What quests do we have? Historian. Virginia, each journal or diary I can find. I haven't found anything on that so far. Uh, breaking the seals. Oh, this that was that weird dream. Yeah, Ventus at Pell's Gate. We'll have to check that out when we head back towards the Imperial City. Um... And yeah, there's this one here, this um, Adelia losing her home. But that means going back to Fort Lucy. And after what we just experienced in that tomb, I don't think, yeah, I don't think we're ready for that just yet. Um, yeah, that's it. That's really, really it. Uh, I found the Fracas Ridge report so far so good. I better do what I came here for and get out before someone catches me poking around in Fracas's office. I have done it, haven't I? Let's just say, break in, replace an official report with the forgery. We've done that. Yeah. Searching the Legion's headquarters to find this report should be quite interesting. Was I meant to find something else? I don't get this so far. So I better do what I came here for cause, and get out. But I thought I had done what I was there to do. The wording on that has me a little a little troubled that maybe there's something else I was meant to do. Right, Fergus, you and I are going to have a wander and uh, maybe drink a little more while we try and find Elveta. Well met. Hi there. Well what? met. It is a privilege. Elveta, there you are. You weren't sitting there the whole time, were you? Fergus, was she sitting there the whole time we didn't even see her? I yes. Well met. Um, that fracas report. Job's been done. Were you successful? Yes. We were. Very good. Now let me have the original report. That was helpful to the righteous and deserves a reward. Oh, thank you. When you're ready for your next assignment, let me know. We need you to stop a raid for us. Okay. Um, okay. What's this about stopping a raid? We have information that a group of criminals is collecting in a nearby ruin, the Aeliad site of Glaive. Oh, Aeliad site. Jonsson's ears are pricking up. I'll mark it on your map. They are short of money and plan to amend that by looting the town. Oh, that doesn't sound good. If anything like that was allowed to happen, we would be blamed for negligence and much of our support would vanish. 
so we must take them out first. At the very least, you must dispose of their leaders. Delena Halvius and Dirth Mag Magenmer. That should be enough to set the others fleeing, but the more you can dispose of, the better, as far as I'm concerned. Make sure you talk to Tubby before you leave town. I'm sure she'll have a concoction or two that will prove helpful. Okay. Wonderful. Let's have a look at what, she, what she's marked on our map. Alien Ruins, Fergus. I told you that I was uh, wanting to start checking these out. Where is it? Right. Is this, uh, this had better be on here. Abandoned Hearts. Valley Cave. Restricted Beach. Oh, there we go. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Right. This is... Uh, uh, it should be interesting. Should be interesting. Oh. Jonsson's quite excited. As a player, I'm quite scared. <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm not sure we're ready for an alien ruin. <laughs> okay, Tubia. Let's go see Tubia. Hi, it's Abia. It's my pleasure. Please continue. Um, Elveta sent me. Expecting a tough fight this time, I hear. Oh dear. I just may have a few things that should prove helpful. Potion of speed, yes. Potion of visibility, bliss. Potion of healing will be needed. Okay, thank you, Tabia. You seem to know exactly what I need. Right, Fergus. Let's go and find ourselves an alien ruin. We'll um, head on out. Shouldn't be too much going on. Not outside the walls of Windfall. And this... Usually it's only when we go to islands that's a problem. Fuck, how'd you do that? Right, Fergus, let's go. Right, we've travelled this far. The heavens have opened up and we are getting soaked. Um... The Hard Luck Caverns is up this way, and we need to head there, and then we need to sort of head northeast from from the caverns. Right, Fergus, let's go. This isn't a a great start. Definitely should have definitely should have got more sleep last night. I can't hear a bloody thing with that thunder and rain. Okay. That's the hard luck caverns, and we need to go this way. Alien ruins, yeah. Jonston definitely excited about this, about what we might find. Although we have to remember we're there to kill some people. Fergus, where have you gone? Don't leave me on my own. I'm sure he'll catch up. This is horrendous. Absolutely horrendous. There you are. Not a day to be out and about. I'm hoping that this alien ruin isn't too far. What's that light over there in the distance? It looks like a fire. Oh, is that the ruin? Uh, it looks like the fire is on top of it. Right, Fergus, keep your wits about you. They might have lookouts or scouts or something. Okay, I want to make sure I have some damage potions on my... Okay. Perfect. Fergus, this looks like an alien ruin. Now, I wasn't expecting... As a player, I wasn't expecting to find an alien ruin in Windfall. So this is... This is cool. Someone needs to trim the verge. Oh. A little bit of vertigo there. Okay, let's sneak, Fergus. Uh, 
I don't think we're going to be welcome. There you are. Can you hear voices? I can hear voices. I think we should maybe check up top first. At least the rain and the wind should muffle some of our sounds. Wow, look at that statue. Johnston's a bit in awe. Okay, there's the fire. Where are they? I can hear their voices. There. I see them. I'm not sure we're going to be able to get the drop on them, though. I think we're just going to have to go head on. Yep, right. Well done, Fergus. Let's get the other one. He's got a bow. Where'd he go? Where'd the other one go? Or did you already kill him? Nice sword. Good to see you using a weapon for once. Did you kill the other guy? And I missed it. Did he go? Okay. Let's uh, go and take the onion. Uh, it's too heavy. We'll leave that. Ah, a couple of beers. Well, we'll take that as payment. A uh, bit of bread. And. A little bit of gold. Don't know where the other one went, Fergus. He might have got inside. Let's get in out of this rain. I am drenched. Okay. Oh, God. Right, let's get this cloak off, because... It's soaking wet. Right, you ready? Let's take our time here. Huh, well, whatever it was, it's gone now. <laughs> huh? uh, gotta love oblivion. Hello, who's there? Yes, it was nothing. There's two of them. I can't see a thing. No, not with that fire stuff. Uh, no, couldn't heal quick enough. That's it, Fergus. You get her. Right, try again. Right, Fergus, as I can't sneak for shit, we might as well just go in all guns blazing. You ready? 
Oh. That was an awful shot. Whoa. Get, no, get out, get out, get out. Just keep running, Yonston. That sword is way too big. Uh! Got him, got him, got him, got him. Come on, fight. Oh, I'm out of potions. Fergus, put the bow away. Oh, you won't escape me that easy. There's another one. Right, we'll sort these out afterwards. Let's take the other one out. Lots of stuff in here. Right, Fergus. Oh. You distract him first. No, Fergus, you distract him. You've got all the armor. Well done. You're hardly a match for me. I think I think we've done it. I think we've done it. Uh, two up, two dead. Time to head back to Elveta. What a success! Is are there more in here? I'll kick your sorry ass to the moons. Damn! Wouldn't let me save. We need to kill this one. Hey! You make this too easy. Where is he? Surrender now, and I might let you live. You make this too easy. Fergus, will you pick up a sword and go and get him? I have you. I can't see. I, I need to get another torch on. And... Also, I need some more... I need some more damage potions. I'm going to have to make some up as well, I think. Okay. Come on, fight! Right, Fergus, ready? I will enjoy this. this. I'm glad I'm not the only one who runs away. Oh, you little git! Fergus. Ah, well done, Yonston. Okay. Now, I am saving while I can. <laughs> okay. Let's check this place out. Path of the Marauder Archer. Oh, I think this one of those books where you can actually change your class. Um, I'll have a look at that. I'm not going to, but it just, just out of interest. Don't need any of this stuff. No. Actually, you know what, Fergus? You grab her arrows because we probably should take. Um, you probably should pick those up. Oh, I'm so thirsty. Do you have any drink? I do. Have a have an ale. A good ale is always welcome. Thank you. You're most welcome. I'll have one myself now in a minute. What's mine is your. I'm gonna sort out these. Give you these arrows. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Maybe we could talk a little. What do you think? No, not now, Fergus. As you wish. Pick your time. Farewell. So it's, you, it's definitely a stress response with you, isn't it? Okay. I want to go and search this other room, and then... I really want to explore this place, Fergus. What's she got? A torch. And that's it. I'm going to take a robe. Because that'll be handy for the... For when it's cold and wet outside. And torch. And nothing else we want. Those are big swords. Okay. What else have we got in here, Fergus? Have a look around. <coughs> Have a look around. Yep. Food. And we'll presume this is their food so that it's it's fresh. 
apart from the moldy pear, obviously. But that's useful for ingredients. Now, what did I see up here? Fergus, look at this. I actually don't look yet. <laughs> oh, oh, brilliant. Potions, lovely. Lockpicks. Floor diamond. And, yeah. Don't want that book. Right, Fergus. Fine steel long swords. You've got weapon. We should probably get your weapons repaired at some point. I'd say they're probably not in good nick. Right, Fergus. Let's check this place out. Which way? Fergus! Where have you gone? Fergus! Okay. Jonsson's just amazed by this place. Are these things? Welcome fragment. Can I? Got it. Nice. Okay. Recently used pickaxe. I think we've already got a pickaxe. Underneath all the alcohol. I need to, um... Where are my spells? Get Fergus to me. Go ahead, friend. I'm all yours. Yeah, don't wander off. I just, I need you close by. We God knows what's Bye. in here. And there might be more of these bandits or marauders or whatever. Oh, look, another chest. Okay, no traps. Gold. Yep. Okay. Leather greaves. They might be good for wearing outside. And... Doesn't mean anything to Yonston, but he knows it might be worth something. Don't want that. I do want the gold, though. Never pass up a few coins, Fergus. Nowhere did I put that. Let's see what else. Is that it? Is that. Okay. Right, the other one. There's probably stairs leading back down. Let's check it out first before we go. Oh, Fergus. We have company. We have company. Go and sort her out, will ya? Whoa. Sorry, sorry, Fergus. Is there someone else there? Open remotely. Okay, we're going to have to find another way around, Fergus. That's a... Uh, that's a ghost. Can you shoot it through the hole, Fergus? Marauder Battle Mage. With nothing of use. As I said, stay close by. There's someone else in here. And that's not the spell I wanted to use. Needs to heal up a little. There's more of these stones. Like 
Fergus? F Fergus! You make this too easy. Where have you Take got that? Fergus? Ah, oh, ah. sorry, Fergus. <laughs> ah, <t> <laughs> Don't hurt me. Come on, fight. Yeah, that'll teach you. Unknown alien cast key. Mutton. I don't know any of that stuff. Right, Fergus. No, we can't get through there. Let's go this way. Yeah, they're these... Jonsson would have been aware of these stones. He would have Sven would have told him about them. And that they have a magical Fergus. Now which one I think I had Fergus on a hotkey. I can't remember which one I had him on. He's still trying to fight that ghost, isn't he? Okay. Right, Fergus, I've got all these stones from in here. You try and get some if you can, and stop running off, please. Okay, and let's see what else we've got going on in here. Oh, hello. Strange. More stones. So yeah, Sven would have would have uh, spoken to Jonsson about the Aeliad ruins, and Jonsson will be aware that he can restore his magicka with these stones. That's how he knows. Nicely done. A couple of potions of healing will do nicely. And another one. Quick check for traps. Okay, we'll have all of we'll leave the the gauntlets. I'm quite happy with my own special gloves. Oh, what was that? Hello, Fergus. What's this? Okay, something somewhere has happened. It's not in here. Okay, let's head back the way we came. Lots of, uh, how many have we got now? Welkin stones. That's fragment. Where are the Welkin stones? Ten of them. Okay. They'll come in useful. And at worst, we sell them. Whoa! That's what it did. It opened that door. Ready, Fergus? We have a ghosty on our hands. We can deal with ghosts. Feeling accomplished, Fergus. We've come a long way. Well, I did take a bit of damage. Let me just heal up. Actually, bandages, bandages. Use the bandages. Right. Need to. Do you know what I should do? I should hotkey those bandages, actually. That would be make things a lot easier what will we do do we have anything on eight we don't all right bandages on eight lovely okay fergus look at this place lots more welkin stones that i can't reach okay now with regards to these jonson doesn't use any weapons right but Fergus does. So, I need to work with game mechanics and try and roleplay and do the story. So, I'd like... I wouldn't mind people's comments on this. My thoughts on it are... I'm going to add a simple spell. I to, think I need something to drink. Yeah, you and me both. I'm going to add a simple spell in, which will allow me just to knock these down. For story purposes, Fergus will shoot them down and I will get them. As I can't get Fergus to shoot them down, I need a, a mechanic. So, does that... Could that work? I, I would be interested in your thoughts on that. Otherwise, 
all these Welkin stones I'm just not going to be able to get to. And it doesn't make sense when I've got the Fergus with me who is competent at using a bow. So I'll leave that one there with you. And what I will also leave there, I think, is this episode. We something tells me there's a bit more delving. There's a whole, there's a, another door for us to go through, which is probably going to be another level. Um, so there's more to do in here, and I think we will explore that in the next episode. So until next time, from myself and Jonston and Fergus, hope you're all well, and until then, take care. <laughs>